Today I'll be showing you Ready For It by Gabor in the color Shaded Biscuit. Hi guys, welcome. So today I'll be showing you guys this new style here by Gabor in that color Shaded Biscuit, which is personally my favorite color by Raquel Welch in this Shaded Biscuit. And now Gabor is having those colors in these five new styles. So, oh my gosh, I am super excited about that. I'll be bringing you guys this review in partnership with Name Brand Wigs. So if you ever have any wig related questions or you just need help finding that color or that style or whatever it may be, you can reach out to them at support at namebrandwigs.com or just give them a call. They are there happy and ready to help. Okay, y'all. So, Gabor just came out with five new styles. This one, of course, being the longest, I had to get my hands on this one. As soon as I seen the Gabor model wearing this style, I was like, oh my word, that one is most definitely screaming my name. <laughs> Have you guys ever looked online and you're looking at these styles and you're like, yes, 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 that's my style there. <laughs> that's exactly how I felt when I saw this one. I, I love this one. She is a lovely, lovely style here. Okay, so those five new styles are a part of their 2023 summer collection, which is a part of their designer series collection. They have some stuff going on over there. Gabor has really, really stepped up their game. I have always been a huge fan of Gabor wigs. I do love the Gabor styles that I personally have in my collection here at home. I've always been a fan of the Gabor style and and I think that's because they kind of go off from the Raquel Welch. They're all in that family. Y'all all know that I'm a huge fan of Raquel Welch wigs. Ready For It is a long wavy style here that has an extended lace front, a hand tied top, mono top up here, which is going to allow parting all up in this area. So today I have her parted in the middle. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, last week I already, when I got this girl last week, I got her out and I was in love instantly. And when I get those wigs, I, I love playing. So I felt like playing and I took some photos and I had already posted. So if you look at some of those photos, I have her part over on the left, but today I was feeling like a center part, so that's what I went with, and I thought, ooh, with these waves, she looks nice in that center part. Sometimes I'll get some wigs that, you know, will allow me to do that center part, and I, for my face shape and for me personally, I just like mm, not feeling the center part. But I think I'm feeling the center part today. I'm I'm liking that. I'm I'm liking it a lot. <laughs> she also features an average size cap. You all know I have a petite size head measuring 21 inches in circumference. So this one did fit me just a tad bit loose. Not much at all. Honestly, not much at all. I did use those adjustable straps and tighten it up to fit my petite size head more comfortably and she she's fitting me just fine. She also has those heat friendly fibers, the true to life heat friendly fibers. So if you wanted to go and just make her completely straight, you can do that. You want to go in and add more curl, more wave, you can also do that. So the bangs on ready for it are 13 inches. The crown is 16 and a half inches. The nape is 14 and a half inches. The sides are 14 inches. And that back is 16 inches. And this girl weighs 5.7 ounces. Now let's take a look at the inside of her cap. Ready for it features this extended lace front, hand tie top here which is going to allow parting all in this area, bendable ear tabs, 
adjustable straps. Open weft it throughout the rest of her cap and she does have some stretch. Now let's take a look at her all the way around. Hey guys, it's been a few days since I did my review for Ready For It by Gabor here. And um, it's date night, so I went and pulled this one out and I thought I want to wear that beautiful wavy long style tonight. And then after I put her on with the outfit that I had on, I thought, you know, I think I'm going to add just a little bit more curl to her. So I did. What do you guys think? <laughs> I think it turned out pretty good. It's still a little bit, probably a little bit more curlier than I want it for tonight, but it will loosen up. And then after I give it a wash, it'll loosen up even more so. But anyways, I just want to show you guys what I did to it. I think it turned out really, really great for date night. All right, so I'm gonna go get my tummy full and spend some time with the husband. The color SS Biscuit GF 1923SS is a light ash blonde blended with cool platinum blonde with dark roots. Okay guys, thank you all so much for joining me today, but before you go, be sure to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And if you're over on Instagram or Facebook, you can find me there at Let's Talk With Kim. Stay well, my friends, and I'll be seeing you soon in my next video. Bye guys.